Hey, welcome to another Bonpai video and my name is Art. This video is a bit of a follow-up on the previous Q&A video that I did and Robinico asked in that video whether I would be continuing car spotting and yes I am car spotting continuously however I'm not posting videos like that. I'm posting videos of the A86 all the time because that's well what keeps me busy at the time and therefore I thought I'll follow up with a GT86 that I recently spotted. And this GT86 was uh, parked nearby my house in the parking lot actually uh, just one block away. And this uh, GT86 will always be there in the early morning and then be gone in the afternoon. Which led me to conclude that uh, the owner of this GT86, uh, well I spotted her once, is a commuter. Because she is probably uh, parking her car here, because it's free parking. This is like the first street where you have free parking and the next street you have to pay your money to actually park your car. So this is the first street where you actually can park for free. She parks her car here, probably walks towards the nearest train station and as I'm living between two train stations in my hometown, uh, it could be either one. So I think she is commuting. Uh, another possibility would be that she is actually working in the city center of my hometown, but I think that's less likely, especially because she's coming in early mornings, leaving somewhere around four o'clock in the afternoon. Well, the GT86 itself, uh, it's an expensive car, so this must be someone earning quite a lot of money. And I made an analogy of the GT86 with the WRX. The WRX, you pay basically more than 50% in taxes. The GT86, it's only about 30% in the Netherlands. Um, well, anyway, the car is very expensive in the Netherlands to own, and you don't see them too often. And especially this car, I think this one is about four years old, on the verge of. Uh, it's well maintained, so I'm not sure if she is the first or the second owner, but you know, that doesn't really matter. It's a new car, it's an expensive car. And to be honest, if I would have a GT86, I wouldn't park it in my neighborhood as the parking spaces are really, really tight. So, you know, cars damage easily and mine already got bumped into twice by someone. So yeah, it's a bit of a surprise that they are parking here in this area. Anyway, that's it. I've spotted this car. Um, I haven't seen it uh, in the past week, but you know, this is a fresh car spotting that I did. And that kind of concludes this video. And I hope you have enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoy these car spotting videos as much as Robin Nico does. And let me know what you think about it in the comments below. And keep on uh, the lookout for new videos. New videos are coming up. I have a a lot of things piled up but I haven't got the time to actually edit those. They will be uh, probably posted near the end of the week maybe the week after and probably they will be about the A86. Thank you for watching and see you next time.